Time for Mr. Truck, reviewing the latest innovations for your truck and trailer. Mr. Chuck here. Now this is one of the products you'll want to share with your friends. This is such a, a great product for safe towing. I mean, WaySafe has always had a scale on their, on their hitches so you could tell what your tongue weight was. And that was a big, important part. A lot of people don't know what their tongue weight is. And now they've added weight distributing hitch to this tongue. It is so cool. It comes with spring arms and the sway control built in the swing arms like a lot of your better weight distributing hitches are. This has the best of everything. It's heavy duty. It's powder coated. And all you do is you take three measurements off your trader. You save it in this app that it comes with. And then you put you do those three measurements to find out what your tongue weight should be. The, the computer actually figures it all out, gives you a range of tongue weight. And then you adjust this lead screw, which goes to an arm, which is attached to your spring arms. So it actually can raise or lower the pressure on your spring arms, which actually distributes the weight. You know, trucks have all this weight on the back axle. This runs it forward to the front. So you're using all your bearings, all your brakes. Then with the trader, levels everything out. It's wonderful. And you can do it after you're hooked up. You don't have to go to the scale a hundred times and try to get all those numbers you want to get. You'll know your tongue weight. You'll know what you want to change your tongue weight to for the right, right distribution. And you just use this lead screw, which attaches to an arm, which is connected to the spring arms. So that's how it works. And then you dial it in with, with a wrench that it comes with, lower or heavier, and get the ideal tongue weight. So not just now will you know the tongue weight, you'll also be able to adjust the tongue weight. There's nothing like this out there. It's so exciting. We're doing a lot of tests with them. We'll show you what sway control looks like hooked to the trailer. I'm going to show you all the, the attachment, what it takes to, to uh, install it. And it is, it's a heavy duty hitch. It's, it's wonderful and it'll do so many things. I mean, this is the missing link and it took them years to develop it. I was waiting and waiting for this. It came out. I think I'm one of the first guys to get a hold of one of these and it is plain exciting. It's going to be awesome. It's available now to buy. We'll have it on my website. It'll be all over out there. But these guys have worked hard on this and it's the it's ultimate solution. You can't beat that. When you have weight, sway, sway control, and you have weight distributing hitch and you have tongue weight and the readout and the adjustable tongue weight. Who has an adjustable tongue weight? It's marvelous. So watch this whole video because we try to go into all the details, all the questions you're going to be asking about it and show you how we install it and everything we've done with it. And it's just it's just so cool. You'll you'll want to share this product and share it with your friends because it's it's one of the most incredible things I've seen in a toy industry in a long time. Well, <laughs> here we are flying down the highway, and I am 5820. Yes, put this four wheeler on here, it's a side by side. So the trailer plus it equals 5,820 pounds. So that's what we're towing. And what I ended up setting on the tongue weight about 600 pounds this trailer because of the way it's configured with the axles has a little higher tongue weight than most trailers because the axles are a little farther toward the middle because it's a tilt trailer it's torsion axles so to get it real low to the ground for loading cars and trucks uh, it's, it makes it uh, a little different than most trailers your RV trailers are really similar to this one uh, then your commercial trailers your horse trailers are a little further back and usually the Dexter axle rules is like two-thirds and a third for axle placement but anyway, and we're testing out the sway control. You can't make this thing sway. Those spring arms are nice and tight, and they slide through the trailer tongue brackets, and that little L piece grabs it as it tries to sway. It's like going around a corner. And it's greasable, it's you know, it's all heavy duty, but very good control on a trailer. And uh, you know, we may try to get on some really heavy trailers. This is actually rated 15,000 pounds with 1,500 pounds of tongue weight. That's your 10% tongue weight. And I got the scale, I can see everything. It is so awesome. But uh, yeah, we're gonna be working on this project and show you all the videos we have. We put it on a, a Chevrolet 2020 Silverado 1500. We put it on this Ford F-150. 
and it's uh, you know they go all the way up to twenty thousand pounds if you need something bigger and like a two and a half inch uh, receiver hole for the the adjustable shank to go into and this one's a two inch so that's why it's rated fifteen thousand so you can go all the way up the right hitch up to twenty thousand pounds which is a lot with weight distributing that's very impressive you know what your tongue weight is. Tongue weight is very important to your safety and your sway and all those things. So this, you line up your tongue weight, get your, your load right, so the tongue weight's correct, and you got weight distributing hitch with sway control built in, so you know you're going to have control of that trailer. And, you know, trailers can be kind of scary if you don't know what you're doing. I've been towing them for 40 years, and I still tow some stuff in the mountains, some 40-footers that I tow. They're a little on the scary side. But this is how you get confidence when you're towing. You get the right kind of hitch set up right, give me the right information. You use the app to dial everything in. And then you store the information in the app for each trailer. You'll probably adjust your hitch height for each trailer and uh, the tongue weight. So you can do all that and save all the information for each trailer. So this is really impressive. I love the sway control. I love the adjustable. I mean, who else has a weight distributing hitch that you can adjust? The spring arms. I mean, that's just it's unheard of, and that's why it took so many years to actually create this and test it and get it ready to go. And I'm one of the first guys to test it, and I just think it's great. So watch the whole video because it's it's got a lot of information in it. And this is just the sway control one that I'm doing going the highway with the corner to corner it tucked right behind the trailer. Did not make me feel uncomfortable at all. It's a great product. Now the trailer we're using is a load trail tilt car trailer 22 feet long weighs between 45 and 4600 pounds and the axles are fairly forward on this and torsion axis so it's low to the ground it's actually double framed so this is a little harder to hook up than what you'd be on like an rv trailer which has the trailer hitch higher in the air and lots of room for your spring arms adjustment to get to 32 inches this one is lower to the ground but we're doing, because it's double framed, I'm measuring from the top rail, the rub rail, where the stake pockets are, and I'm measuring the front and the back of that to get it leveled out on as level a piece of ground as I have, and that's what we're doing here. Measuring to the top of the rail, which is what you see there. Measuring it front and back, leveling out the trailer that way. See so about two feet in the front and two feet in the back. And that's how I get the trailer level. Of course, you know, on an RV or horse trailer, you'd measure to the most level place on the trailer, front to back. So that's what we've done there. Now, next, I've got to level out the Waysafe actual hitch head. And according to the instructions, that you need to be an eighth of an inch for every 100 pounds of tongue weight. So I've got to lower the adjustable shank and get it uh, to where it's below the hitch by about an inch uh, so that's uh, about between eight and nine hundred pound tongue weight on this it's a heavier tongue weight than most trailers so I'm going to put it about an inch below the coupler and we'll try that next so that's one eighth of an inch for every hundred pounds of tongue weight so I've actually had to lower it on this truck which is a 1500 Silverado RST I've lowered it to the lowest holes on this particular shank. And this is the 15,000 pound trailer way safe, which goes to 1,500 pound tongue weight. But there we are, I've lowered it. Now I can hook up and do the next step. I've gotten to where I use weight distributing hitch about all the time. It helps with the wind on a tall trailer and it helps with sway control. And what safe, way safe has done with this new hitch is a real similar design. It has uh, friction control in the, uh, spring, in the uh, spring arms going to the bracket that attaches to the, uh, the trailer tongue. And so it'll work very similar to what I'm used to and it should have great sway control. But it's an easy system to put the spring arms on. And now we're gonna switch these to the brackets that came with Waysafe. There's the brackets, by golly. Gonna put them on next. Okay, I've got the brackets on. They're very adjustable. Everything on this is heavy duty on this true toe from Safe Way Safe. 
and it's interesting and I lowered it down to where it was below the coupler that's what the instructions say so we got that done now also in the instructions they tell you on the, on the brackets that you are should be about 32 inches from the coupler but it said if you don't have enough room you can do the 27 because that's the range is 32 to 27 that gives you the right amount of length so the spring arms don't pull out turn around the corner and we've done all that now on this trader because I have too many Danes in a way I'm 27 inches but uh, on my RV trader we will go 32 on it when we install it on that next so we're getting closer now there's a little L bracket that holds the spring arm into place and over here this is this cool tool that's what cranks the adjustment for your tongue weight so you can actually move tongue weight around or pay you know tongue weight yeah and this actually allows you to shift it by putting pressure on the spring arms and it's got a tool that helps pop that spring arm into place i'll show you that here in a little bit this is such a cool tool this bar here which you can see how i have it hooked in there and then that is used to lift the spring arm into place and that's what you see and on this end it has that three quarter inch uh, and it's a closed end wrench and this end has the hook to spring this loaded spring arm on there so we've got that puppy on there and I'm going to use it to tighten up this three-quarter inch nut on top which will change the tongue weight now you will need to get chain safety chain extensions and you know I use two different types and this is one that most people have is this type you screw it in there but you got to get one that's rated for the same as your safety chains but I use two extensions right now so that's one thing you will have to do is lengthen your safety chains or you can just get different chains or add a link to it and I did really well my extension cord for the wiring did reach I was worried about that but it did reach here's the hitch that started it all from way safe it's all aluminum, nice and light, that nice round gauge that shows you how much your tongue weight is. And it's got a two-pin lock on it. The same two-pin lock is also on the new True Toe. But, this is the heavy-duty shank that this system comes with. It's all solid steel, powder-coated, and it's heavy-duty. This is an arm. This is a wrench that comes with it. It's got a three-quarter inch box stand on one side to turn all the bolts on your your hitch brackets and your lead screw then on the other end you can actually use it to lift your arms into place your spring arms and there's those heavy duty spring arms that is what uh, does all the work this is what lifts the hitch up and they're you know solid steel everything on this is heavy duty powder coated and this is what lifts your arms up to level out your rig and the lower your tongue weight and there's the head that's the main hitch head that's the only system I know of that can dial in the tongue weight up or down with the wrench anywhere you are it is so cool and then the hitch head is you know interchangeable balls it's got the two inch and a two and five sixteenths and it uh, fits the shank that we just looked at and it's adjustable and that um, is where you, you actually would do a bolt in the hold the ball on top of the load cell which is down below the ball and that's a slotted ball so it can move up and down with the weight of your trailer all heavy duty and it's uh greasable it's got three I think three or four grease circs on it for all the moving parts and there it shows me with a wrench tightening up the actual ball in the slot and then these are the L brackets this is what the spring arms slide back and forth on for your sway control and they've got pins that hold it in place, an L pin on the L bracket. They're adjustable up and down to get the right height of your spring arms. And these are the brackets that bolt to the actual trailer hitch, the trailer tongue, I mean. And they're heavy duty again, powder coated. And that's what your L brackets go on. Now, there shows the two pin lock, just like on the original aluminum model. And this two pin lock is how you adjust it up and down on the shank. It's very adjustable to the height you need it. And then, of course, it's lockable, so you don't have to buy a lock for this part of it. It's a locking two pin rascal that holds the hitch head on there. 
and that uh, you can see also in, in that picture the uh, the the lead screw on top that you move back and forth to adjust your tongue weight. There's that scale, that rotary dial scale that I really like. You look on there and see exactly what your tongue weight is, and you can adjust it. And this is the app. It's on your phone, so you can put all the numbers in there, and it'll tell you what tongue weight it is, what eight, what to adjust it. You do some measurements, you enter all that stuff in there, and uh, figure it out. And then you can store all your information on your trailer too. That's what this is. It's one I particularly got is a 15,000 pound hitch, 5,000 pound tongue weight. But uh, that's the first section you put on. You put the hitch head on the shank, and then you're ready to add the spring arms after you do the other few things. You weigh it, weight your tongue weight. I had this on about two trucks, I guess a Chevy and a Ford, trying it all out and lining it all up. And this is an incredible piece of machinery. It's well made, it's all heavy duty. And this will tell you everything you want to know about safe trailer towing, adjusting your hitch properly. It's wonderful. <music>